So now the major road for Benin City this is New Lagos Road. Today is uh, December December 3, December 3rd. See now I see a rusher for Benin. You see with uh, Shai Bojo Sai Party. They just said to me. And now, uh, now, Papa, now I get Benin now. Uh, anybody will talk, you follow up. I walk with the center maker, you know what to do. See, see at this thing. See. see uh, we are past like the week. Uh, my people, now here, uh, Erosha carry coffee. Now, coffee they sell for all those places there. Erosha carry coffee, go put for another person's ass. Eh? Landlord see coffee for front of a company in the morning, not be wrong, leave a uh, ass. <laughs> no, you ask me now. Papa said, like, you know, if you do work, he said, you want to go carry another person, come make a call, replace him. Eh? Now, to the carry people land, people land, to the smuggle land from Edo people, you carry and they share and give you friends. All the land way, way there, those state now. If you get empty land for Benin, you go, the dog go put down, that's your food from Edo GIS. Papa said, like, you don't carry. I don't know what they do now. Live work with the center. See, see, see no, middle of Benin City. I go go punish that man. You see the coffee where they say for you see coffee for inside there now. Erosion carry coffee, carry casket. Go put for another person house or front past front of church. You know. <laughs> now they know. I don't be playful now. See, open wire. You are close eye. Follow this man. Now we are, now, they are, now this kind of erosion now now see they use now the witness. Where did they to carry this erosion come up for the main city? Uh, <clears throat> our country people, my Edo people, it too why have uh, you see this video, you people just watched. See how these guys, you know, lamenting, talking about the erosion in their area. A whole full community, no road. Not only this community, many communities in Bini is like that. We are not talking about the people from Edo Central now. I remember those people there. Our people there have been crying for Bini, Aonshi Road for months, and they keep telling them there's nothing the governor can do about it. Uh, is it Saple Road? They said there's nothing governor can do about it. We are not talking about I do not now. Talking about Benis. We are not even talking about Orion or local government or via local government to all those. But this Benin, we are talking about one local government Benin now. The governor that cannot take care of Benin city. You expect the governor to take care of the whole state? The truth, I will tell you. You see, election is coming. Election is coming. A lot of people they are going to learn new things in this coming election. It's not going to be like talk by kind of election 2020 it is 2024 it's going to be different election different campaign different strategy that is what i want our people to know people are going to fight especially people from edo central who have been glamoring clamoring for edo central man to be the next governor which is not wrong in that you understand the state is for everybody you know, people from Edo Center have been crying. This same governor neglected them. This same governor did not do anything in Edo Center. But we are not hearing that cry now. Why? Because the governor wants to pick somebody who they don't know. Somebody like him. So we are not hearing that cry. And it is politics. Don't blame them. That's what politics is all about. But it's Obaseki, really, like a Bini man, really, the, the Obaseki is a. Is a governor because you understand the people, the Benins really. What can you point at and say Obaseki have really done? I know Obaseki renovated some many government buildings, really, like Secretariat. He repent. Uh, he did not build any new stadium. He did not even renovate stadium. He painted it. He did not build any airport. It obviously did not build any airport. The secretariat he renovated. He did not build it from scratch. The governor, the hospital, Stella Abasejo Hospital, he did not build it. It was built by the former governor, Lucky Igbinejo. Point at one thing, Obaseki have done newly. So Obaseki started from scratch. He finished it. He promised 200 uh, jobs for Edo youth, 200,000 jobs. Where is the 200,000 jobs? 
He promised to build Gele Gele. Did he build Gele Gele? I remember this our brother uh, in UK when he, he joined Labour. I was in Nigeria when he made that video. The video is with me. When he was saying it's not campaigning for the governor again, when he was having Mr. Asai with the governor, he's with Labour now because of the things governor promised. The reason why he joined Togba, he measured this Gele Gele. All this thing I'm saying now, that's what he measured. That's the reason why he will never support. But today, he's supporting that same governor. He makes a video and says he will never because he has failed. It is that's the politics. A lot is going to play out. Yesterday, somebody from uh, this Obaseki camp, let me advise you people. There is this uh, dictatorship spirit. Obaseki have that same dictatorship. He wants it all. He wants everybody to, he wants to be in charge. He don't want anybody to challenge him. He wants to be the master. He said that you obey, you say yes sir, to him or you or he will kick you out. You have that spirit. Don't argue with him. Whatever he wants to do, when you say, no, I don't want it like that, he will hate you to the last. Just like he wanted the Bini Atifa. The king said, no, it's not yours. Ever since, you all see how Obaseki behave. Obaseki, we are talking about nobody knowing him in Naido. Before, before Oshomole, Oshomole imposed him on us. He, he, there is no single video to show Obaseki, you know, speak Edo, uh, speak Bini. You hear your governor speaking Bini. I have seen other governors, Yoruba governors, even Igbo governors. They'll be speaking during their campaign. They'll be speaking their language. I know Edo is... Yeah, it's not for one tribe anyway. But what I'm saying, when you, are, when you are with your people or you are in the palace, show me one video where at least you say, this governor is one of our own. About, uh, Chumbo, Chumbo brought him from Lagos. He never based in Benin. He resided in Lagos. They brought him. I'm not saying Lagos people are bad. I'm just, it's a stranger there. That's the reason why that connection is not there. That love, that understanding is not there. There's something I want you people to know, these Obasaki followers, you know, that dictatorship, you don't want, you hate criticism, you don't want people to criticize who you are, who you support because they feed you. Everybody's not like that. Somebody called me yesterday and said, there is a certain uh, lady, said the lady's not from Edo, because they know how I feel when it comes to Edo's matter. You, when, when, anytime I see people disrespecting the Bini, I take it personal, like this uh, Mecca and the rest, I don't like it, you are, your name is a Mecca, you are Igbo. Even though you claim your mother is Bini, no, no problem. We are all one Nigeria. We understand. But what you are saying, you, where you live, where the, where you are born, is also your land. You protect that place. You can't be disrespecting, insulting. You just come out and insult the Bini living in diaspora. That case is still there. We are going to ask you someday, somehow, what is pushing you to be talking like that if you don't know where you are. That's what I have against. I have nothing against you. That's it. So somebody called me and said, ah, there's another lady who is a uh, Igbo. That's what he said. Hey, he wants to do this. This is what Bini people do. He's insulting, showing uh, bad roles about Obaseki. This is what, how a uh, maker started. People clap for him. He reported the case. I said, okay, no problem. Because I don't need a situation where foreigner will come and use opportunity and say things, people will clap for them, later they'll be insulting, we don't need everybody go and do whatever, it's activists go and do it in your state, I said okay send me the video, he couldn't he said, uh, okay, I asked people you know, my older civilian, who is this person this guy is talking about, the people very close to the governor, who showcase governor I don't want to mention it for you, but if the person see this video and he, he understand I'm talking about him, he say anything then that's it, I don't give a shit, I don't know the governor I don't know, I'll tell you. So he said that woman, that woman must leave, he must, we must. Ah. So after uh, I called somebody this morning to say, ah. so I understand. Why are you telling me this? You have been with the governor. Governor, the governor take care of you people. You are, you are, we all did this talk back for the governor. I don't know the governor. I have not met with the governor. I have nothing to, we have no connection. He's the right guy to support at that time. That's all I know about this governor. When I said he did not fail totally, but he failed in many aspects. That's what I know. And he cannot impose anybody on Edu. Cannot be somebody like him. Impose it on Edu. We, we hate God for that reason. If he had, if, why, if, like, after his eight years, he leave. Though this guy that called me, I was asking, why are you calling me? Is Obaski looking for third time? Obaski wanted second time and he's there for the second time. I'm not somebody. Tell this, oh, this is who I support. Edo people will choose if they will support that person or not. It is his own work that will make Edo people support. Why are you telling me about this guy? You expect me at the age of 50 to go out to be like, talk, like, making video insulting somebody who talk about the bad rules in Bini. A, a lady you, you claim is, is not from Edo, maybe Igbo who went to school in Bini. 
No need for that. If she, if she, if she can say, oh, this road is bad. It's for the governor to come and do it. But by the time she is insulting or disrespecting the Bini, then we'll not take care of her. For now, she have not really do anything about that. I don't know why you are telling me. I'm not, uh, uh, I'm not like, uh, uh, people who fight for God. I don't know, God, who the fuck is governor? Like, uh, somebody so bad road, the governor did not do. I should go and tell that person, because what? Because governor feed me? To hell with governor, to hell with whoever. Don't bring that shit. Don't, that shit, because that's what they do. This is uh, dope babe. The same thing when she talk about governor. Oh, I'm a, it is freedom. Of, let any, anybody can talk. Nobody's stopping anybody from talking. But what we are saying, you don't play this tribal card. It's about tribal card because they know when, oh, this is evil. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is not. She have done nothing wrong for saying that. We don't really hate these people. If they if they respect us, we respect them. If they are nice to us, we are nice to them. If they continue, not all. We know the people we are fighting. We are fighting this IPOB Igbo and, and normal Igbo that sympathize with them. Because this IPOB Igbo will never change. That is people I have war with. I don't have war with Ijele. Ijele is my friend. I don't have war with Blessed Dom. She called me once in a while. She, uh, Blessed Dom. I don't have uh, war with... I have so many Igbos that called me and say, ah, don't generate... You know, on my... Comment, comment session, you see, 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 come. That the reason why they don't watch me is because I generalize it. That's how I do. I'm doing it because the way your people generalize it, how to generalize it to, but in my heart, I don't hate every one of you. you oh, everybody cannot be bad in every tribe. Everybody cannot be bad. So, my brother, I was surprised. You can, I'm not that kind of person. You just call, you can call people, people of your class. I'm in, you know, higher class. You understand me? So, that's it. Uh, uh, Edo State election is coming. That's the reason why who I'm supporting now, who I pray is party to give him the ticket is Pastor Ize Yam. Is who I am praying for. The is party to give him the ticket. Is you who I know. The past election is uh, is him that everybody was talking about. Everybody was, you know, we we have investigated him, talk about his family, everything about him. Is who I know. The rest, you guys that is warming up, I don't know them. Is it Agba? And the things Agba did that was not right. I have, you know, when he, he went to the upper palace, we all know these things. And, but they are repackaging the game. Is it uh, uh, Igodalo who uh, can't even speak his sound very well? So it is Isaiah Yamu that I know that I'm like, kind of praying because I know that what happened before, the things we, they, they said or we said about him was not true. People were confessing. They just say these things to rubbish him. So I, that, that guy was not too bad. He was a good guy. So I pray his party give him a ticket. So that's it. My name is the Wunder Silan. Thank you and God bless.